people in the crowd But I only see your face in all the lights And as the bass keep pounding on me, baby I really wanna make you mine I don't really care about love I don't really care about happy ever afters Something about you gives me hope Something about you, yeah Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Proud of Your Coily wig again. I'm showing you guys what it looked like straight on my head. So I definitely needed to co-wash it and shape it and, you know, get it looking right. So I'm using my Whole Blends Conditioner to co-wash it and I just um, uh, finger detangle it. The hair is like really easy to finger detangle. I don't need a comb or anything. And then I'm going to just rinse it out and then begin my twist out. So this is the Proud of Your Coily wig in 14 inches. I love this wig because you really don't have to do much to it at all. The cut of it is amazing. You guys will see when I put it on, it's like a super easy install. And it does have a little bang in the front. So I decided to do a twist out. I'm using a lot of body leave-in conditioner. And I'm gonna start with the bangs first because I just wanted to get those out of the way. And I'm just gonna twist the hair all around in medium sections. I think all together, maybe it was about 30. I'm, I'm just estimating y'all, maybe about 30 twists, maybe about 40 twists. But yeah, as you can see, they're like medium size and it didn't take me long to do this part at all. So when I twist the hair down, so I'm just adding a little bit of product to each section, smoothing it in, detangling it, and twisting it all the way down and making sure to twist the, um, twirl the end of the twist around my fingers. That's how it helps it to have that nice little curl. And I'm gonna do that all over. I'm working in like vertical sections. So I did three vertical sections in the back, if that makes sense. That makes sense. So I'm just starting from the bottom of each section and working my way up. So this is what the wig looked like after I added all of the twists. The twists are so juicy. I just love how natural everything looks. So it is the next day and I'm going to just apply um, a wig cap to my head so I can protect my hair underneath. Now this wig is very special to me you guys because I reviewed this wig like four years ago on my channel and the video got so many views. It got like 600 thousand views or something it was very popular and i just wanted to you know revisit revisit the wig and see if it's just as good as it used to be and it is the same quality y'all like i just love it i i really really like this wig and i like the fact that i can just throw on the wig and don't have to do much to it other than take down the twist like i don't have to worry about you know doing the lace and laying it down and doing all that type of stuff you guys will see once i start taking the twist out that i really don't even have to take the lace off like if i want to i could keep the lace on the wig so i'm just showing you guys a close-up at the twist and just so you guys can just see how just natural the hair looks like it really mimics natural hair and i love that
they're super bouncy as you can see now i'm just going in after i do the first round of taking down the twist i'm going back to each twist and just separating it a couple of more times the hair is super curly so i'm just separating it where it naturally separates and it's so curly that i can do it a couple times so if i have like one twist i can separate that like five times if that makes sense so yeah, you guys can see that the hair is getting bigger and bigger and curly and, curl and curlier. And when I bend down like the top part, it looks like scalp. Like this wig is just perfection. So after I'm done um, taking out all the twists and may, uh, just separating them, making it as big as possible, I'm gonna go in with my pick so that I can shape the hair. It's very important that you shape the hair to your face so that it can just, you know, and be yours so it can look better natural you know what i'm saying you don't want to just throw on a wig like you gotta do something so my whenever i put this wig on my twists were like i say about 90 percent dry so i'm just going in with my blow dryer at the roots and it didn't take that long at all and blow drying at the roots helped it to get a little more volume as well y'all i still have on the lace so y'all look how good it looks like you can't even tell i still got the lace on the wig oh my goodness oh my goodness so now i'm gonna finally take it off so i'm just cutting off the lace straight across like i said i don't really have to do much to it and whenever i apply it again i have the adjustable strap on in the back it comes with adjustable strap and it has um a clip in the back and then two clips on the side so i'm putting the clip in the back and i think one only one clip because i don't like to just add all the clips my i get headaches so yeah you can just um apply however many clips you want to it just depends on your level of comfort so i'm just showing you guys a close-up of the hair texture i really love y'all this hair is bomb so soft has so much body so much just movement it's just perfection i can't stress it enough i really really love this wig this is my favorite wig from her giving hair still to this day If you guys want to check out this wig, I will have the link down below in the description. Her Given Hair has a ton of different wigs, you guys. A ton of different textures, different styles, different color wigs. They have so many wigs on their website. So I definitely recommend trying, if not this wig, then any other wig on their site. Thank you so much, Her Given Hair, for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I love you guys. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.